All right, Tell Keaton is a bit of a summer town, but when it comes to year-round success stories, none is better or rounder than Mountain High Pizza Pie. The Purple Pizzeria is the phoenix that came out of a fire over two decades ago and now flies high under the watchful eye of New York born and bred owner Todd Bassalone. All right, Todd, we're here at Mountain High Pizza Pie. Give me five. Yeah. Good God. Tell me something about this pizza that I don't know. Well, I don't know if you've had my pizza or not, but... Uh, I haven't. Been we're making we're looking forward to it. Yeah, we've been making it here for 21 years now. As Todd Bassalone strolls and surveys his pizza success, the dough, the toppings, the pizza... How is it? Yeah. Delicious. I'm going to go full Harry Met Sally. Oh, my. Customers savoring the pizza they just ate and taking some home or maybe taking one more tasty bite. And how is it? Delicious. <laughs> Todd is the pauper to Prince pizza success story. Uh, I started at the road house so I originally worked for K2 Aviation when I came to town and this place had a fire and I bought a burnt building. The roof was gone and basically everything else but the foundation and Todd will tell you he was basically broke but he had a dream. I've always been enthusiastic about pizza. I started making pizza. I started pizza 14 years old, right? Yeah. And my sister From an Italian family in New York City, and then get this. I started selling pizza on the road with the Grateful Dead back in the, oh in the 80s. Gosh, yeah. So, 21 years doing this. What a long, strange trip it's been. And Todd didn't do all this alone, so he pays it forward, and he's open year-round. It's a big part of the community, having place to come in and sit down and have a pizza. And speaking of sitting down, Carly and I were ready for a mountain of pie. Dave, I don't know about you. It's been a long day in Talkeetna. I'm starving. We've been in the sky. We've been on the ground. I think I'm leaning towards the Main Street gossip. We're leaning? Are we doing some leaning? We're doing some leaning. some leaning. But I think I'm going for the carnivore, but I am going to add like a, a veggie, just so it's just not so meaty. <laughs> so just like, a, a, like, give me one spinach leaf. So ordered and off to the pizza yeah, factory. Yeah, so this is our kitchen. This is Andrew, my kitchen manager. Here's our pizzas being made. Carly got the Main Street gossip with spinach, bacon, chicken, all topped with ranch dressing. And I got the carnivore with a sprig of spinach and while they were cooking Todd surprised us with a doughy delicious spinach artichoke appetizer I kind of already a... took a bite I was so hungry <laughs> the big dip so good then our pizzas were ready sliced and on our table boom look at that oh thank you so much <laughs> I'm using a spatula only because this is on TV oh my there goes my top oh, oh. Mm, right off the bat oh my god that's so good hold on you can't you know how the drippings are when it falls off that's the best part, the cheesy, gooey part. But maybe the best part of all of this, owning a successful pizza restaurant, well, it may have been just a pie-in-the-sky dream, but now after 21 years, Todd can honestly say he's earned his pizza wings. Road tripping in Talkeetna. The pizza is... Heartwarming. I'm Dave Allgood. It looks amazing. Great job, Mr. Allgood. Okay, Todd told us the secret to his pizza it's the water. I don't know if you've heard about this, but the water makes all the difference. He doesn't use tap water. He uses delicious natural Talkeetna water that he hauls in from his house. And no surprise to Dave and Carly, last year at the Vegas Pizza Championships, and yes, that is a real thing, Mountain High Pizza Pie placed third in the world. He takes his crew there every year, and uh, like Dave said in the story, they are open year-round out in Talkeetna. All right.